Hi everyone, welcome to section 2 of this video series. Harness the power of web, entity, video and image search. In this video we will provide search results using Bing Web Search API and show how to call the API using REST and SDK. Let's start with setting up the API. The Bing Web Search API is part of the Bing Search v7 APIs. All fall under this API. So there's only need for one service and one API key to use all of these services. Let's create the API key in the Azure portal. Let's create a resource. We can search for Bing. And we see the auto suggest already picks up the Bing search v7 right here. I can click on create. And let's find a meaningful name for this one. Let's call this Bing Search API. I can create several pricing tiers. So I can go for the S1. If I click on full price details, I can see the offer. And you will see that the price goes up if you need more transactions per second. And the free one, three transactions per second, 3000 a month for free. And yes, one I just created was $7 per 1000. And you can see it has a limit of 250 transactions per second. Okay, let's set it up. I can create a new resource group or I can just pick an existing one. And we can click on create. Okay, it has been created. And let's grab a key. And we'll let's just test the API reference console. So, as you can see here, this API gives us the ability to call web, news, image, video entity, and visual. If I click on the uh, web search API, you can see you can call the endpoint. And if you scroll down, you can see all the headers and all the query parameters you can use. So to recap, first create a resource group in the Azure portal, then create a Bing search v7 service, and get the API key in the endpoint, and you can start using the API. So that's it for this video.